So now in this video we're going to take an NPN bipolar junction transistor and make kind of a night light by using a light dependent resistor. So I made similar circuits using the 555 timer. Those, those were more for demonstration. This is a more practical uh, circuit for a number of reasons. So in any case, we have the light dependent resistor. Enough light is falling on it right now that the transistor is off. If we get it darker, so I'm going to kind of slowly get it darker, there you can see we have uh, some glow as I get a little darker the glow increases uh, rapidly and now I think the transistor is on fully I think it's saturated but now it definitely is so in any case we get it bright enough though then the LED turns off so that's cut off right there when there's some glow that is the active region and then uh, when it's dark enough that's saturation right there that's transistor bipolar junction transistor terminology so we have the circuit here we need to get uh, less than 0.6 volts approximately to cut off where the LED doesn't light up at all. When you get close to 0.6 volts, that's the active region, you get some conduction, the LED glows a little bit, and then when you get uh, somewhat above 0.6 volts, closer to 0.7 volts, then it starts conducting fully, as you can see there. That's uh, transistor terminology. So with any uh, given value, light dependent uh, resistor because there are some that are slightly different but I think this is the one that comes with the most kits uh, you'll have to vary the resistance on the positive side a bit but the main thing is we want it to be close to 0.6 volts when there's a certain amount of light falling so I just uh, use different value resistors until I got the result that you see here I think this worked uh, pretty well my next lower value is at 10,000 ohms and the next higher value that I got is 22,000 ohms uh, so we have put like some in uh, series or some in parallel to get uh, slightly different than that with the kit that I have so you can make those modifications as needed so we got the LED here and of course the long lead the anode on top the shorter lead the cathode if you didn't trim them towards the bottom the NPN bipolar junction transistor there 2N3904 if you're using a different transistor, there's a good chance it has a different uh, pin layout. But if it's bipolar junction and it's a 2N, then it is probably the uh, left pin, which is on the bottom, is the emitter. Middle pin there is the base, and the top pin there is the collector. And again, this is kind of a switch, but we do have the active uh, region there. So if for some reason you want to get rid of the active region, you have to make a Schmidt trigger. Uh, version of this with another transistor but uh, there's a good chance if you need a circuit like this this is just fine where you have the active region where there's some light when there is uh, some light above it as well so any case hope you enjoyed make sure you check out one of the other videos that I'm posting to the screen and check out the links down below they all help out a lot I'll see you in the next video